I, you know, when I grew up, the way I got involved with soccer is my friends played the, the sport. So it, there wasn't youth soccer uh, back then, um, and I played all the sports. So soccer was the fall activity. I think I was about ninth string midfielder, and I, that's why I became a goalkeeper. Yeah, when I look back, my greatest contribution, my greatest significance to the game is without question my camps. Soccer plus goalkeeper school, soccer plus field player academy. And when you, you have a chance to work with a young, motivated athlete that has aspirations of being the starter on his high school team or being the starter on her club team or playing in college, um, it's great to work with that level athlete. You know, when I think of my career, I'm very proud of, you know, my accomplishments with the USA national team. Certainly the Olympics in 96, the first ever Olympic gold medal for women's football. The 99 team and, and what they did um, against all odds. They're still the only national team in the women's side of the game to, as a host to win the uh, championship. And then my 2008 U20 team, players like Alex Morgan and Sidney LaRue and Megan Klingenberg, players that we saw last summer and uh, winning a world championship with them in Chile. I mean, those three all share a very, very special place for me in coaching. I've been a national staff coach with the NSCAA uh, National coaching schools for a number of years and it's a wonderful organization. They approach teaching coaches with a holistic uh, mentality, knowing that not every coach is a former player or can perform certain skills on the field, but they are coaches and the NSEA knows if we can help them become better coaches, we're helping the players that they work with. I mean, I look at the NSCA and know it impacted my life. I mean, from um, learning from other coaches, and there's tremendous coaching knowledge in this association. So going to sessions or just sitting around and talking with other coaches, uh, you learn that it's not the X and O's that make the coach special. It's how they impact the people, the players that they're working with. And, um, you know, people like Anson Dorrance and um, Booch Meiernick and, you know, Shellis Hyman and, and so forth and so on, Jeff Tipping, many, many coaches that you pick a piece of, of their brilliance from them and you try to incorporate into your own coaching. So it's, it's a great organization as far as um, a coaching community. And I'm very, very proud to be a national staff coach with the NSCAA.